Here comes the double champion. The following champion vs. champion contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Dublin, Ireland. Weighing in at 267 pounds. The WWE Intercontinental Champion. And one half of the Raw Tag Team Champions, the Celtic Warriors, Sheamus! I can't imagine the amount of pressure he's feeling carrying around two championships. Yeah, the pressure's on when you have one title. But with two, it has to be immense. A victory tonight over Damian Priest not only protects his career, but supercharges his superstar. The Judgment Day is here. Everyone in their way is doomed. And his opponent, representing the Judgment Day, from New York City, weighing in at 249 pounds. He is the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Damian Priest. The Judgment Day have become a well-oiled machine of brutality. The Judgment Day can beat you in so many ways. The numbers game, brute force, or pure intimidation. Yeah, basically, they become of one mind, a singular focus of dominance. A win for one is a win for all, and they all will win tonight. Continues to grow as well, Michael. They want to be feared and respected. Well, I don't respect them, but I definitely fear them. The devious and destructive Damian Priest in action here again. Punishment personified. There are few that carry out the ruination of so many opponents like he does. When Priest sets his aim, it's best to get out of the way. He doesn't miss. Certainly not a man whose crosshairs you want. He could pin his opponent right here. Whoa. Only a one count before the kick out. I can't believe the ref didn't get two here. And Sheamus is countered. Incredible display of athletics from the Colossus. Sent into the corner. Veteran instincts from Sheamus. Yeah. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm. 
For Sheamus to come out on top in this one, he needs to focus on cornering his opponent and unloading his most brutal offense. He can't get tricked into a cat and mouse game. He needs to trap his opponent with big hits. That strategy certainly does play to Sheamus' strengths as a bruiser inside the ring. There's a lot of hard ways to land, but that might be the hardest. Scooped up and down. Scooped up. Tombstone slam. Off into the pin. There's two. Big kick out. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. Oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Sheamus looked like he may have been the one to receive some lumps there. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Sheamus doing what he can do to stop the beatdown. Yeah, Sheamus able to momentarily stop the bleeding, but will he also gain control? They're gonna have to try to fight out of this. We're about to take a trip south of him. That could be Sheamus' demise. Two count. He kicked out at two. Oh, man, somehow Sheamus managed to kick out, and I don't think he's going to take too kindly to how close that just was. That was close, but Damian Priest doesn't look like he's letting that distract him from the task at hand. Power slam. Punishing their opponent. Loving blow to the chest. He's taking some good hits. a barrage on their opponent. Boom! Oh, and a stop. Debilitating attack on the leg. Sheamus is taking complete command. I like what Sheamus is doing. Trapping his opponent with big hits, and it's paying major dividends for the Celtic Warrior. Reversal! What a counter! Boom! Running STO plants him. Nicely done. Stop after stop after stop. Sheamus had this. A cover. And a kick out. I don't know what type of dark forces Damian Priest called on there, but it worked. And Sheamus is definitely no stranger to an epic battle, but he really thought he'd won the war there. He's turning the tables. And he has an answer for Priest. And another counter. We're witnessing insanity. These superstars are chasing glory. But who will reach their breaking point first? Who can hold on? Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. Heads outside. Damian Priest. Rip locked in. South of heaven. Priest was right on target. Turn around, the pin. The referee is missing the pin. That's good. Performance. Seamus can't be happy with this outcome. This is going to be eating at him for a while.